What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. In today's video guys, it's going to be all about this 4th of July makeup tutorial. So guys, in this video, I went ahead and did something a little bit new with my makeup routine. And honestly, it came out pretty nice. So if you guys want to see how I glammed up for this special occasion, then you guys better keep on watching. Alright guys, so as you can see, I kind of did this um, concealer mask. And I wanted to do this because I'm going to add in some eyeshadow and some glitter pigments to it. And I feel like if I add that with my basic face already on, it might ruin my face. So I'd rather just be safe than sorry and just do the eyes first and then the face later on. Alright guys, so I'm going to start off with the eyes today. And I'm going to go with Life's a Drag by Lunar Beauty. Love you, Manny. And I'm going to be taking the shade Snatch this red shade right here and I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the Mikasa E300 brush just give this a little tap and I'm gonna go ahead and add it all on the crease I honestly forgot how pigmented this eyeshadow palette is and um, which is not bad I'm really glad I got my money's worth then I'm gonna be taking the Morphe R39 brush and I'm just gonna go ahead and blend the color because not only do I want this color bright but I really want this color blended out as well. All right, guys, so this part is going to be very interesting because I'm actually going to go ahead and add another layer of concealer on my eyes so I can kind of give it a little bit of a cut crease. So I'm just going to go ahead and add in some dots of concealer. And me opening my eyes like this is going to kind of help what I need to conceal out. All right, I zoomed into my face so that way you guys can see how I'm going to do this. So I'm just going to go ahead and carve the... I, it might get a little messy, but it's totally fine. All right guys, so now that your eyes are fully concealed, now we can go ahead and add in some glitter pigments and I'm gonna be going in with the NYX glitter primer with the NYX glitter pigments in silver. Then we're gonna go ahead and place the primer gently all on the lid. And then as very carefully as I can, I'm gonna go ahead and place the silver pigments all over the lid so i don't know if you guys can notice this but there's some glitter all on my cheeks and this is why i wanted to do the eyes first so that way if there were glitter on my face i can just wipe it off and reapply the primer again then i'm just going to go ahead and bring some of the glitter to the corner of my eye all right guys do you see it coming along i'm really excited for this and then of course i'm going to go ahead and add on some primer on the other eye. I honestly forgot how messy glitter pigments were. <laughs> oh goodness. All right guys, so now that this silver pigment is on, I'm gonna go ahead and go back with Lunar Beauty and I'm gonna be taking the shade Fishy and I'm gonna go ahead and apply it all over the bottom of my eyes. This is like a good American blue color. All right, and the next thing I'm going to do is add on some lashes and mascara. But first, I just got to curl these lashes to perfection. I'm going to go ahead and be taking the Benefit Cosmetics Bad Girl Bang Mascara. And I honestly am obsessed with this. It honestly lifts and gives your lashes that natural but yet spidery volume that it deserves. All right guys, and for the lashes today, I'm gonna to be applying the Morphe lashes and this is Flirt Alert. And I'm gonna go ahead and carefully place them on as usual. All right guys, so this is how the eyes turned out. And I really am obsessed with the glitter pigments. The lashes, they could be a little bit more lifting, but hey, it's Morphe, so can't really blame the brand, but it's all, it's all cute, you know? Don't have a problem with it. But overall, I'm really digging this eye look, but I need to go ahead and finish the basic face. So I will see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys. So I just have on my basic face right now, but I feel like I need to be glowing. So I'm going to be taking this highlighter from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is the M. Reezy highlighter. You guys know that this highlighter is... I barely even put on a little bit and it's already glowing. But I was going to say, we already know how this highlighter is. It is seriously pigmented to the makeup gods. I hope you guys bought backups of this because um, once this is gone, it's gone for good. Thank God I have like three backups. This is perfect. This is great. All right, guys. And now it's time for lipstick. And for lips today, I'm going to be taking the Jeffree Star Cosmetics shade Red Rum. This is a true red that would be perfect for this 4th of July.
All right, guys, so I got to seal the deal, and I'm going to be taking the Urban Decay All-Nighter Setting Spray. We're just going to spray that all over the face. All right, guys, so this is the completed look for this 4th of July. And let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit. You guys see that? I'm so happy. All right, guys, so this is my completed look for this 4th of July. I really hope you guys do love this video. And of course, if you guys do love this, please give this video a big thumbs up. It'll mean so much to me. And do not forget to press that big old red button that's to subscribe. Also, guys, please, please be careful today. Do not hold fireworks. I've seen videos of people that got into some accidents with fireworks. So just please be smart. Have fun, but just be safe as well. That's all I have to say to you guys. <laughs> all right, guys, I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, everyone.